friends. Hey friends. Well, today we have a very exciting day in front of us. Do you know what that means? We're not gonna tell you yet. You're gonna go, go and comment down below where you think we're going. It probably it's gonna be in the title. <laughs> I'm your Huckleberry. Is that a movie? You've not seen that for the movie. Apparently Doc Holliday said that. Oh. He says, um, I'm your Huckleberry. Well, we're going to Tombstone. Tombstone, Arizona. And it's gonna be fun. Have you been there before? I think I went, mom and dad, correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe I went with you guys when I was really young. So oh, yeah, I don't I remember. remember it. Supposedly the road used to not be paved through there and it's paved now. So it's gonna be fun. We're gonna take you along with us. Supposedly it's a hunt town. A ghost town. Not a, 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 no. a haunted town. It's a living town. It's a living town, but it's a haunted town. So, it's gonna be fun. We already did our morning routine, Ooh. which we're trying to do like for 30 days. My abs are on fire. Yes, I'm tired already. Actually, I've bruised my butt bone too. No <laughs> kidding. It's sore right now. You guys need to know that. And, okay, let's go rolling to the tombstone. 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 There we go. <laughs> Let's drive to Tombstone. Let's go. Okay guys, cat's out of the bag. We're in Tombstone. Tombstone, Arizona. I'm so excited, this looks so cool already. So let's go and check it out. We got front row parking, that's awesome. We may be in time for a shootout here, I'm not quite sure. So I've decided, since we're in Tombstone, I have to find a saloon and grab a beer. I feel like that's literally the only thing that I can do. Um, actually, I guess it would be more like a whiskey or a bourbon is what they would have drank, but I don't like either of those. So They're a little a too stout. So like a beer will be perfectly fine. Um, so I'm gonna. Me, I don't like beer. Maybe a prickly pear margarita. Ooh. 
I may even have one of those. Uh, so I'm gonna do a little bit of research. I'm not, I, I, I come ill prepared. I have no idea a lot of the historic places aside from like the OK Corral, which we just walked by. Um, Boot Hill, I know that. Um, the other place that you said that we have to go? I think it was OK Corral. Oh, really? Or Boot Hill when we were coming in. So I don't know, we'll do a, a quick little bit of research because we do actually have some service here. And then Let's go ahead we'll make some decisions. <laughs> What did you order? You ordered for me a free here. What? Margarita. <laughs> I've never seen this before. <laughs> Are you excited? What are you gonna eat? Veggie burgers. Somehow. We did. Have the first bite. Oh, okay. Buen provecho. Buen provecho. We met the new owner of Big Nose Kate's saloon. His name's Steve, and he actually recorded this. A lid. <laughs> he was so nice. I didn't know it was the owner, so he was like, get in the bar. And I was like, oh, <laughs> I don't know if I'm doing things wrong. And then they were like, he's the owner. That's, and I was like, oh, okay. They said, that's actually an honor. He doesn't do that often. So we're like, <laughs> Cool. He probably does that often, but still. Still, it was pretty cool though. And then we met some locals as well. So we're gonna just roam around and check out Thumstone yeah. after our bellas have been pulled. Ooh, I'm stuffed. I'm stuffed too. That would be good Bitch burger. Let me help you. Okay, for you folks that are just joining us, good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to the world famous Birdcage Theater. Now, this is one of the only original buildings in Tombstone, and it's the only original building here on Allen Street. And back in the day, Allen Street out here was 16 blocks long, and there was 106 saloons on it. So my only critique is that it's been widely publicized, popularized. Well, what were you expecting? I don't know. Apparently the Birdcage Theater is the only place that's still original. And everyone's making a profit. They're all profiteers. Which I guess is kind of the, the Tourism, story behind yeah. Tombstone anyway. Just the guy went out searching for... I don't know, something, and he was told that he'd find his tombstone, and well, he found a big silver mine, or a big silver whatever, and turned into a silver mining town. I don't know. It has been very nice, but I just think it's... You will have to pay for everything. Yeah, we don't want to pay for everything. Yeah. It's nice, though. It's cute. It's really cute. But... It makes me want to build an old place that looks like one of these things in it. I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised at this point. Wow, wow, wow. And there's where I go like this. Uh, I 
haven't shoes. Oh. <laughs> Yagji Mash. We're getting a tattoo. We're getting a gun. Oh, a gun tattoo. That's nice. I like that. All I can say is, really cute place. If you want to just come and check it out, we spend like fifty dollars in things there. Are not even the real buildings. It's cute. It's fun. We love places filled with history. Yes. And it's nice that there's at least one original building here. Yes. I wouldn't pay for anything else. So we've made it to Boot Hill Graveyard. Uh, this is one place that I was okay with spending money. It was only $3 per person to get in. And there are a bunch of people buried here. So I am curious to see what's going on. Ooh. 